This is a prelude to the prelude of the prelude. Um, I may post this. I may not. I don't know. I don't even know if y'all care. It is hot here in AZ. Um, I'm originally from the Midwest, so I'm not used to all this heat. You see that? I think we had one, as I said before, probably one to two days of that cloudy, overcast, um, about to rain situation. That was Sunday. Um, I'm really upset about this situation. I'm breaking out. But um, nevertheless, someone actually asked me, how do you keep your hair uh, curled or flat ironed in AZ? Okay. Um, I have no problem answering it. This is, this was a curl. I do heat um, twice a month. No. I do heat like, like this kind of stuff once a month. I don't do it in between. In between time, you'll probably see this. I pull up in ponytail and call this a day. So if you see me in videos like this, that's because I have pulled up in ponytail, no heat. You get it washed, deep conditioned, call it equipped. That's it. Okay. But if it's not that time, you'll see this. And it all depends on... Sorry. It all depends on the time of the month. Um, I only get my hair relaxed every 12 weeks, so you probably only see this um, once out of that 12 weeks. Yeah, once out of that 12 weeks. So that's how I do it in AZ. I've had people say, I can't keep my hair wrapped or curled in AZ. But what I've learned and noticed, once your hair is trained to do something, it does it. It wouldn't take me honestly if I can go to I can go to bed right now, lay on this, and I would still have the same form. Um, so I can't, unfortunately, I can't say um, or agree with people who have asked me that question because for me, my hair is trained. It can I could put this up in a ponytail right now. I could do one of these situations right now and take it down, and it was gonna fall right back into spot. So, see, saying so it's, it's there, right? I've had people come to me and say, Hey, yo, my hair won't stay bended. I could be in one of these contractions. You see this? This is a contraction. You see how that? Yeah, yeah, that's a new word. You see that? Just look at your skin. My voice, my voice still going. Just let it shine through. And just let your skin pass. Until your love so fast to smooth. But just let it shine through. Now. Just let your ooh, ooh. So good. See how we went back? Told you. It's strange. So, uh, I'm sorry I can't answer that question, but I say is, is if you keep doing something, it becomes a habit, and it's, uh, it's, a, re it's a religious act for me to get my hair relax, uh, relaxed now, 12 weeks out, a religious act for me to get my hair shampooed, I have regular maintenance on it, unfortunately I cannot shampoo, condition, curl, straw set, wet set, need anybody else set to my own hair. The only thing I really know how to do and I mastered really good is a ponytail. And um, sometimes they, they failed me. So, yeah, that was that question I had. How are you able to do that in Arizona? Yeah, it is hot. That's true. It's hot. When I first got down here, my hair had to go through a change. So I did some shedding. Now, I'm off work. I'm off work. Who's calling? How am I answering it? Because I'm off work. I don't need to be in this room because I'm off work. Okay, so um, it went through this transformation. I don't know if you could see. Um, I did, I had some shedding, but if you could see, probably, oh, let me see if I stop it right there. I got my hair rinsed maybe in 
last month, last year. And the rent is growing out. So it's about right here. It's pretty cool. So now in the sun, because Arizona sun will, will do some stuff to your hair. You see how that look like? Too? Mm -hmm. It'll do some stuff to your hair. Um, it, it's coming back. I may not. I'm not going to get another rinse. I think I'm done. I won't dare, dare, do color. Not at all. Um, so, everyone that's on YouTube that says baby your hair and and don't do this to your hair, don't do that, they are 100% correct. See, you thought I was going to say they wrong. No, they correct. Don't do extra things to your hair. Your hair wants to be treated as gently as possible, just like your nails. Now, I cut my nails often. My nails grow very, very long. I cut my nails often. Okay? I can show pictures. My nails are very, very long. I can grow my nails like that. But since I'm diabetic, I really need to make sure that I properly groom my nails and my feet. So I monthly, I tip out by. And I do that for a reason because I make sure, you know, the situation is right. I look at my nail beds and all that. And I do look at my scalp and all that good stuff. And I think this, let's see, I'll show that picture. See? I can grow, see? Same thumb ring. I don't know how you think I'm lying. I ain't lying. Look, same thumb ring. There go the thumb. That's the ring. See? So I can I have the capabilities of growing long nails. I just don't because I don't want um I don't want anything to do something happening with my cuticles due to my diabetes. Okay. So I um trim them off. I don't keep it. But it, people ask me, Well Yolanda, how do you do that? I don't do that. That was, that was it. I don't do it. It's not me. I don't. I do take vitamin. Let's see if I can find a bottle for you. I'll give you a moment to read it. Yes. They have these in the increments of. Is it three? Yeah. I think they have three different increments. Um, a lot of people are confused. Excuse me. A lot of people are confused in regard to this. This MCG. Okay. MCG is a micro milligram. Most uh, vitamins do come in micro. They don't come in milligram. MCG. Micro. So it's one millionth of a gram. So technically, this is only really 10 grams. Milligrams, excuse me. Milligrams. Technically. So... People get these and they go get the one, I think it's 1,000, 5,000, and the 10,000. People get these and go nuts. Like, that's too much. I'm taking 10,000 milligrams. No, boo boo. Learn, you you got to learn. You, you, you got to learn it. You got to learn them. You got to learn them. I'm sure this was somewhere on a periodic table. You got to learn them. So, this one you only have to take once a day. Don't ask me how much I take. take once a day and I'm moving over to that organic stuff so since FDA didn't approve this I guess it's organic <laughs> I do go to the health food store and buy items like this but this I like it I like it I used to use the 1000 it didn't work much but I do see that's why I, that's why I yep right there it don't stay down very long, y'all. Cause right there, ooh, 
Nobody want that in their mouth. Okay, but yeah, I come prepared. Yeah. So, um, it promotes carbohydrate, fat, and protein metabolism, hair, skin, and nail health. Hair, skin. And nail health. Now, this is my own little review. I get, you know what? I've seen people on um in um YouTube do they review. It's so cute. Someone do one. <laughs> this right here. It don't do a thing for my skin. If I could take the glasses off and show you, I have some issues going on. It don't do a thing for my skin, but for my hair. Chai, chai cheese. It do something for my hair. I will give it that. So do I like biotin? Yes. I tried the other stuff. <sighs> Guess I'll do this video over. Y'all don't want to hear all this. It's 11 minutes already. Bye.